I've always been a morning person. The idea of being warmly greeted by the rays of the sun through my window signals a new day. Another chance to be grateful, to celebrate small and big victories, and most importantly, an opportunity to positively impact another person's life. Waking up as early as 4.45 a.m. helped me to get centered by engaging in a conversation with my Creator and seeking to strengthen my relationship with Him. The start of the lockdowns brought so much uncertainty in everyone's life and being reminded of God's promises to His children was what kept me strong, hopeful, and grateful through an uncertain season of my life. During this period of isolation, I developed a deeper appreciation of the beauty of commonplace episodes. Like seeing my bonga villas first thing in the morning, the birds in flight, There's the magnificence of the sunrise. And the majestic melancholy of the sunset. Feeding my soul by reading his word while basking in the glory of the sun and hearing the birds chirping made me realize that if God takes care of everything that you see, how can he not take care of you? God knows every detail about you, every desire of your heart, every worry that keeps you up at night. He knows you personally, completely. I will always look forward to being awakened by the dancing rays of the sun flirtatiously peeking through my window because there truly is magic in the early hours of the morning that can never be replicated. And as F. Scott Fitzgerald once wrote, and I quote, for what it's worth, it's never too late, or in my case, too early to be whoever you want to be. And it is also my hope that you live a life you're proud of. If you find that you're not, I hope that you have the strength to start all over again. And that's what early mornings are for.